Have you ever pondered over the connection between your mind and your financial wellness? This is a question many of us might not have considered, yet the answer lies in a concept deeply ingrained in Japanese culture, mindfulness. Mindfulness, or the practice of being fully engaged in the present moment, has its roots in the Zen teachings of Japan. It's not merely a philosophy, but a way of life that permeates every aspect of daily living, from the simplest tasks to the most complex decisions. Mindfulness encourages us to be fully aware of our surroundings, our actions, our thoughts and our feelings. It teaches us to live in harmony with the world around us and in doing so, to cultivate a sense of peace and contentment. But how does this translate to financial wellness? Well, it's simple. When we are mindful, we make better decisions. We become more aware of our spending habits, our financial goals and the steps we need to take to achieve them. We learn to appreciate what we have, rather than constantly striving for more. This sense of contentment, in turn, attracts more positive experiences and opportunities into our lives. Yet, the power of mindfulness goes beyond mere contentment. It is also a potent tool for attracting wealth. Yes, you heard it right. The Japanese have a unique approach to wealth creation that hinges on the power of the mind. It's not about working harder, but about working smarter. It's about harnessing the power of your thoughts, your intentions, and your actions to create a life of abundance. The Japanese believe that everything in the universe is energy, including money. And just like any other form of energy, money can be attracted or repelled depending on your mindset. A positive, grateful and content mindset attracts wealth, while a negative, discontent and fearful mindset repels it. So, if you want to improve your financial situation, the first step is to cultivate a mindful mindset. Practice being present, being grateful and being content. Trust in the process and you'll be surprised at the doors it opens. Now let's dive into a real life story from the heart of Japan, demonstrating this intriguing link between mindfulness and wealth. In the bustling city of Kyoto, a group of entrepreneurs embarked on a journey that would change their lives and fortunes forever. Here, in the heart of Japan's cultural center, a story of transformation unfolds that is as captivating as it is enlightening. These entrepreneurs were not unlike many of us. They had dreams, ambitions and businesses they poured their hearts into, yet they found themselves caught in a whirlwind of struggles and uncertainty. Their ventures were floundering and their spirits were flagging. The vicious cycle of financial stress was taking a toll on their personal lives, leading them down a path of distress and disillusionment. In the midst of this turmoil, they stumbled upon an ancient Japanese philosophy, mindfulness. This was no magical solution, no overnight fix. It was a new way of life, a change in perspective, a journey towards self-discovery and inner peace. Intrigued and desperate for a change in their fortunes, they decided to give it a try. They began by incorporating mindfulness into their daily lives. Simple practices like taking a moment to breathe, observing their thoughts without judgment and focusing on the present moment became a part of their routine. They started their day with meditation, took mindful breaks during work and ended their day reflecting on their experiences. As they embraced mindfulness, they noticed a shift in their mindset. The stress and anxiety that once consumed them started to fade. They found themselves more focused, more patient and more resilient. They were no longer reacting impulsively to situations, but responding thoughtfully, making better decisions both in their personal lives and business affairs. Their businesses too began to reflect this change. They started implementing mindfulness in their work culture, encouraging their teams to take mindful breaks promoting open and honest communication and fostering a work environment that prioritized mental well-being. The result was a more engaged, motivated and productive team, leading to better business outcomes. The transformation was remarkable. Their businesses started to thrive and their financial situation improved significantly. But more importantly, they found a sense of peace and fulfillment that they had never experienced before. They were happier, healthier, and more content with their lives. Their journey of mindfulness had not just changed their fortunes, but transformed their lives. 
The transformation of these Kyoto entrepreneurs is a testament to the power of mindfulness. But how does this work? Let's delve deeper. The journey of these entrepreneurs is not just a tale of financial success, but a lesson in life. It's a reminder that wealth is not just about financial gain, but about overall well-being. And that, perhaps, is the most valuable lesson we can learn from their story. Mindfulness, an age-old practice, holds the key to unlocking your financial potential. Now, you may be wondering how exactly this ancient technique can be linked to modern-day wealth accumulation. Well, the answer lies in the fascinating world of neuroscience. When we practice mindfulness, we are essentially training our brains to stay focused and present. This is achieved by activating the prefrontal cortex, the area of the brain responsible for executive functions such as decision-making, attention control and emotional regulation. This activation, over time, strengthens our ability to make rational and well-thought-out decisions. Now, let's take a moment to consider the impact of this on our financial lives. Making sound financial decisions, whether it's about investing in the stock market or simply budgeting for the month, requires clear thinking and emotional stability. By enhancing these abilities, mindfulness can directly influence our financial wellness. Furthermore, mindfulness helps reduce stress. Studies show that chronic stress can hamper our ability to make sound decisions, often leading to impulsive behaviours. By reducing stress, mindfulness allows us to approach financial decisions with a calm and clear mind, thus avoiding potential financial pitfalls. But the benefits of mindfulness don't stop there. It also promotes an attitude of contentment and gratitude. Instead of constantly craving more, mindfulness encourages us to appreciate what we already have. This shift in attitude can prevent reckless spending and encourage healthier financial habits. So you see, the science behind mindfulness extends far beyond the realm of spirituality. It's a powerful tool that, when harnessed correctly, can lead to better financial decisions and ultimately, wealth accumulation. And remember, this isn't about getting rich quick. It's about fostering a healthy relationship with money and making conscious choices that support long-term financial stability. Mindfulness is not just a buzzword, it's a way of life that can lead to financial success. So why not give it a try? After all, your financial future might just depend on it. The journey of the Kyoto entrepreneurs provides valuable insights into the Japanese method of attracting wealth. This summarizing scene seeks to highlight the key takeaways from our exploration, from the undeniable power of the mind to the transformative influence of mindfulness in our financial lives. The Kyoto entrepreneur's journey is a testament to the potency of this method. They started with a simple yet profound realization. Wealth is not just the accumulation of material possessions, but a state of mind that embraces abundance and prosperity. They understood that to change their financial realities, they had to first change their inner realities. And so they embarked on a journey of mindfulness cultivating an awareness of their thoughts, emotions and actions in relation to money. The entrepreneur's practice of mindfulness was not a one-off event. It was a consistent daily habit. They began their days with meditation, focusing their minds and setting intentions for abundance. They brought mindfulness into their work, making decisions with clarity and purpose. And at the end of the day, they reflected on their progress, acknowledging their achievements and learning from their mistakes. This journey was not without its challenges. There were days of doubt, days of struggle. But the entrepreneurs remained patient, understanding that change does not happen overnight. They held on to their focus, keeping their eyes on their goal, even when the path became unclear. And through it all, they remained consistent in their practice, knowing that each mindful moment was a step closer to their desired financial reality. The fruits of their labor were evident. They experienced increased financial success, yes, but more than that, they found a sense of peace and fulfillment that no amount of money could buy. They discovered that wealth, true wealth, is not just about having more, but being more. With mindfulness, the path to financial wellness isn't a distant dream. It's a journey that begins with a single mindful moment. 
So let's take that first step today. Embrace mindfulness and watch as your financial life transforms from a source of stress into a source of joy.